This Atlantic archipelago boasts near-perfect year-round temperatures, which means that whether it's summer or winter, you can enjoy the dramatic and varied landscapes here that you usually have to cross continents to experience. Looming volcanoes, prehistoric sites, camel rides, lush pine forests, lunar landscapes, and miles of pristine Sahara-style sand dunes. Yes, there is another world beyond the Canary Islands seafront resorts. Take a hike around the base of Tenerife's El Teide mountain, Spain's highest peak. Kidding yourself that you are enjoying a stroll around the surface of the moon. It really is that extraordinary. Canarians love a good party, and in Santa Cruz de Tenerife, the fiesta spirit reaches its sequin bedecked crescendo during the annual carnival. Festivities generally high kick off with a flourish in early February and last for about three weeks. Some of the Canary Islands' most glorious beaches are located in Fuerteventura. Windsurfers can catch the waves at Playa de Sotavento de Jandía, while more water sports are on offer at Morojable's spectacular arc of a beach. They may not sound like the most appetizing dish in the world, but the ubiquitous seawater cooked wrinkly potatoes are a lot tastier in the flesh. The best time to visit this lush ravine in Gran Canaria is springtime, when the almond blossom is in brilliant pink and white bloom. Year-round though, it is still a leafy, lovely place flanked by steep mountains where caves have been dug out for restaurants. High season runs December through April and July through August. Fewer tourists visit in the autumn. Travel costs in the Canary Islands range from less than 60 euros a day for a budget hotel and free museums to over 120 euros a day for a four-star hotel and fine dining. Larger islands have motorways that connect with the airport and to major resorts, and are generally light on traffic. Being outdoors is what the Canary Islands are all about. And the astonishing variety of landscapes here, from La Gomera's humid and verdant Parque Nacional de Garajanoy, to the vast lunar scapes of Lanzarote, means that the same pursuit will be different on each island.